Cookies, coffee, and bagels. The edge here at Celine High offers all this and more. But what's it like behind the counter? What happens when the cell E becomes the cell er? I'm Saturn Allen, and dude, let's try it. So this is our classroom area. First, right. we're gonna stop by our punch cards. Right. So you'll just put it in this way. There you go, I'm in. So let's come on through this way. After clocking in, I headed over to the ovens, where I got to make a batch of the Edge's famous cookies. You can pick your size of gloves. We got medium, large, and extra large. Okay, let's see if I can actually get them on. <laughs> Don't put this in the shell. Next, we're gonna grab a selection of cookies. What I usually do is I just grab a handful out of here. Oh! <laughs> Cut that out. How many, how many cookies would you say you guys usually sell, or at least like make, in a day? Each shift we make two rounds, so that's 12 trays, mm -hmm. and then 12 cookies per tray, so it's a lot of cookies. That's a lot of cookies. To be exact, that's 288 cookies per shift, and over 1,700 cookies per day. We can take these out freshly out of the oven. All right. Now what we do to speed up the cooling process is we slam it down. Grab another one of these Grab trays. Grab another one. And... and yeah, that's the, that's the cookie making process here at the end. Wow, yeah, well thank you. Of course. After making cookies, I worked the register, where, hey, that's <laughs> Lynn Fountain from SHS Today. It's an honor. Who are you? I, I don't know. <laughs> After a long lunch of working the register, making cookies, and learning the ins and outs of the edge, I left with a few newfound skills, and maybe one or two edge cookies. Reporting for SHS Today, I'm Saturn Allen. Back to you in the studio.